people in Yucatan contracted the plague in 1571. One man discovered a plant, and he and other individuals drank it. The chemical turned the subjects blue and rendered them airless. They swiftly relocated to the ocean, they swiftly relocated to the ocean, where they founded the Talakan civilization in the deep ocean. K.U.K. Alkin was born to one of the ladies who consumed the plant. The infant went on to become Talakan's king, then requested to be buried on the land when she passed away. In order to reach the area where he spotted a civilization, K.U.K. Alkin led some guards up. In order to make way for his mother's burial, they attacked civilization. He was known as Namor by one of the locals, which is Arabic for the boy without affection to help her brother and Wakanda's king, T'Challa, who is unwell and in need of a heart-shaped herb, Shuri works diligently in her lab. Ramonda announces the death of the king as she enters the lab gently. Wakanda is still having issues with other countries desiring its vibranium a year later. The Dora Milaje apprehend French soldiers who attempt to break into their position. Ramonda discusses the French heist with the UN and makes the information public. Killmonger when he took the throne. Williams and Shuri awaken in Talakan. In an effort to persuade Shuri of his beliefs, Namor, for losing Shuri, which is made worse by earlier events like the time she appeared to support, Okoye is fired from her post as general in Wakanda after Queen Ramonda chastises her. The following day, Ross shows in and meets with Valentina Allegra de Fontaine, his ex-wife. He also discovers and conceals Kimoyo beads, demonstrates the culture to her and even gives her his mother's jewelry. She rejects the idea of killing Williams. She reminds the nations that they will continue to fight even without the Black Panther. Americans at a mining outpost mine for vibranium in the ocean using a vibranium detector developed by Riri Williams, an MIT student. This is how they locate vibranium in the sea. They are suddenly attacked by Talacanals, who are angry that they are stealing their vibranium. Namor attacks the last survivor helicopter and destroys it. Ramonda and Shuri in Wakanda visit the sea to lament the passing of T'Challa one year earlier. Shuri is not entirely prepared for this, so they burn their burial robes to symbolize the end of the period of grief. Then Namor shows up crossing the boundary by swimming under the water. He informs them about Talakan's existence and asks for their assistance in preventing foreigners from obtaining vibranium. Shuri and Okoye visit Everett Ross, who provides them with the young scientist's name and whereabouts despite possibly disclosing sensitive information. Then, in order to locate Williams, Okoye and Shuri travel to Cambridge, Massachusetts. When they pursue her, to her garage, she reveals that she is creating an Iron Man-style suit of armor. However, the FBI is keeping an eye on them. Williams escapes, wearing her armor, Okoye escapes in a car, and Shuri escapes on a motorcycle. They unexpectedly run into Talacanals, Atuma, and Namora. The following day, Ross shows in and meets with Valentina Allegra de Fontaine, his ex-wife. He also discovers and conceals Kimoyo beads. Okoye is fired from her post as general in Wakanda after Queen Ramonda chastises her for losing Shuri, which is made worse by earlier events like the time she appeared to support Killmonger when he took the throne. Williams and Shuri awaken in Talakan. In an effort to persuade Shuri of his beliefs, Namor demonstrates the culture to her and even gives her his mother's jewelry. She rejects the idea of killing Williams.